Hi class, this book is called Too Many Books by Gilles Thibault. Too Many Books by Gilles Thibault. One morning, Nicholas got dressed in a hurry and ran downstairs to find his mom. She gave him a hug, took one look at his shoelaces and said, Nicholas, I have something for you. Then she searched through a box and handed him a book about how to tie shoelaces. What's this? It says how to tie shoelaces. Nicholas's shoes are untied. Oh boy. Let's take this and put it back here. So it says, how to tie shoes. All right, next page. After Nicholas read the book, he could tie the best bows in the world. Look, his bows are all done. Whoop. The cat has a bow tie too. The toilet paper has a bow tie. <gasps> the mouse. The mouse has a bow tie too. Oh, the skipping rope is tied in a bow. When he finished his breakfast, he brushed his teeth. <clears throat> Toothpaste went all over the bathroom. His dad came in, gave him a kiss and handed him another book on how to brush your teeth. What does this say? It says how to brush your teeth. Let's take this how to brush your teeth and put it back here with the other one. Whoop, it fell. So now we have how to brush your teeth and how to tie your shoes. Next page. After Nicholas read it, he had, after Nicholas read the book, he had the whitest, brightest teeth in the world. There's his book on how to brush his teeth. Then, he tried to give the cat a bath. She did not want one. Cat is not happy. Oh boy. His sister appeared holding a book in her hands. Another book. Oh no! Not a book about how to wash cats. Ugh! Oh, look. It says how to wash a cat. Let's take this, put it on the back with our other ones. So we have how to brush your teeth, how to tie your shoes, how to wash a cat. Next page. After Nicholas read the book, on how to wash cats, his cat was the cleanest, most beautiful cat in the world. Nicholas decided to go outside and play. He tried riding his bike. Whoa, whoa, it wasn't easy. His favorite neighbor, Veronica, came over with a book. Uh-oh. Another book. No, said Nicholas. You've got to be kidding. Not a book about how to ride a bike. So here we have how to ride a bike. We take this, put it on the back. So now we have how to brush your teeth, how to tie shoes, how to wash a cat, 
How to ride a bike. Next page. After Nicholas read the book about how to ride a bike, he was the best rider in the world. To thank Veronica, Nicholas went to the library with her. The minute they got there, she dove straight for the shelves and chose a stack of books, many, many books. Hugging her pile, she asked Nicholas, aren't you getting any books? No, said Nicholas. I'm tired of reading books that tell me how to do this, how to do that, how not to do this, how not to do that. Veronica grabbed him by the hand. Come, come. Look, Nicholas. Over here are adventure books. Over there are history books. And down here there are funny books. To make her happy, Nicholas chose three books. A pirate adventure, a book about knights, and a funny story. On the way back, Veronica kept saying, oh, I can't wait to read my books. She's happy. Uh, I can't hardly wait. Does Nicholas look happy? He doesn't look so happy. Oh, so here it is. Does he look happy to read the books? Mm, here, does he look happy? No way. We take this. We put it at the back. So we have how to brush your teeth, how to tie your shoes, how to wash a cat, how to ride a bike. And Nicholas, is he happy about reading the book? Meh, not so much. At home, he headed to the backyard to play. Plunking his books on the grass, he thought, hmm, should I read a book? Nicholas sat down under the tree, opened the funny book, and started to read. <laughs> he started laughing on the first page. He laughed on the second page. He laughed on the third. He's happy. Oh, the mouse is happy too. It's a funny book. He laughed so hard, his dad opened the door and said, are you okay, Nicholas? He was laughing. <laughs> His mom came out of the garage and said, Nicholas, are you okay? Then his dad, his mom, his sister, and Veronica all sat under the tree. And with a big smile, Nicholas said, listen, listen. Once there was a mouse who, and he told them the story. After Nicholas finished, he was the happiest reader in the world. Look, now he likes books. So we take this paper. Now he likes books. This is the man who wrote the story. His name is Gilles Thibault. He wrote the story, and Bruno Saint Aubin. He do the he did the pictures in the book. So we put this back here. So we have how to brush your teeth, how to tie shoes, how to wash a cat, how to ride a bike. Does Nicholas at first was Nicholas happy to read books? No way. Eh? And at the end of the story, he likes books. Yay! So that was the story called Too Many Books by Gilles Thibault.